Are you excited to find out who wins tomorrow? Inside Falmouth Elementary. Mm -hmm. It's a place full of, of kind people. Everyone knows Mr. Leonard. What was your favorite part? The playing part. Mr. Leonard, he is funny. He is as lively and charismatic. He's really cool and he's really wise too. No, I guess it's just uh, just in the genes. He's been teaching for 20 years. I've got uh, several siblings who have been teachers. My father taught 35 years. My aunts, my uncles, cousins. The whole it's a whole family family affair. The kids think the world of him, and the teachers do too. He doesn't, you know, wear an S on his shirt, but. He definitely has a heart of gold. He's kind of like, you know, a superhero around here. And, and just like a superhero, he has saved the day. We try to talk about all the core values and character values of a superhero. They're honest, they're caring, they're respectful, they're responsible, and um, he embodies all of that. He helped start Power Scholars after realizing the original summer school program just wasn't enough. The uh, parents weren't getting the daycare that, that they needed. <laughs> Now there's an all-day five-week program with the YMCA that makes sure the kids continue to learn during the summer. And most importantly for some of the kids, get something to eat. A lot of these kids, they're, uh, they're not getting good meals outside of, outside of school. It's the problems of poverty. It's the problems of maybe not getting enough to eat and not knowing where they're going to sleep that night. A struggle that many of these kids now don't have to worry about. We're trying to run this program to let these kids know that they mean something, that they can and they will make it in life. And you know when kids don't want summer school to end. No more field trips, no more friends. I found out that it's actually more fun than I thought. It's clear Mr. Leonard and all of these teachers are superheroes in their own right. At Falmouth Elementary, Marcella Robertson, WUSA 9.